Disruption is the theme of the day, and, and I see disruption as innovation, but it's innovation that has a profound change. That's the power of technology, but it's not technology alone. It's people with ideas and people with passion. What kind of skills would I need to innovate? What kind of skills would I need to disrupt? It wasn't spelling. Spelling was not one of the skills, I think, that helped me uh, create products. Creativity is something that comes from within us, and it's something that creates passion. If you get any feeling of art and music being de-emphasized in your school, fight that. That's the wrong move. Art and music are some of the most important things for children. It gets them involved. The first product I worked on at Google came from my actual, believe this or not, I know this is going to sound silly, my passion for spreadsheets. It's amazing when an educator can give a student immediate feedback. It's amazing. Educators change the way they teach using docs, and they do things that they never thought they would do. Optimism is also a skill. Don't think of that as just an attitude. Teach optimism. Model optimism. If you teach pessimism to children, they won't try. Please stop that. That's very nice. Thank you. The field trip is amazing. It's engaging. It's authentic. You really learn. Sometimes it's raining, and that's fun. Sometimes, you know, Bobby eats something he shouldn't have eaten, and everybody laughs, and there's just great stuff. There's research that shows field trips actually are a better way to learn. They're actually an incredible uh, you know, learning environment for kids. They're engaging, and they, they have much better uh, memory. So we created expeditions. We wanted to take students together as a group to places their bus can't go. One of our passions is to help kids discover their passion, and this is a way they can at least start to do it. We tested it in about 100 classrooms. The teacher and the students absolutely loved it. What if we let kids discover their passion and we help them discover something that is disruptive? Let's give kids an opportunity to dream and to disrupt and put in them these skills to make great products and great things that actually are great for people.